Praxis Prepper. Hey everybody, this is Praxis. Ugh. <laughs> I forget what I'm even saying. Okay. Hey everybody, this is Praxis with a quick tip about how to pack more stuff into the same amount of space in your pantry. But first, I want to remind you that tonight at 8.30 Eastern Standard Time, we're going to be doing the live stream related to the Project Homestead series right here on our channel. If you have any dreams yourself of starting your own homestead, starting your own retreat, or even have just questions about general emergency preparedness, please feel free to join us tonight at 8.30 Eastern Standard Time, and we'd be really happy to answer any questions that you may have. As you can see here at our homestead, the Things are really starting to come together. I've been putting things uh, on our pantry shelves, which I just built yesterday. Uh, and a, uh, something came up while I was been packing things on. I want to share it with you guys. Uh, one kind of challenge, oftentimes, when you're putting things onto pantry shelves, uh, is you know how efficiently things can fit, especially when there's boxes. Sometimes there'll be extra space at the top, and like it's kind of hard to utilize all that space. Now I custom built these shelves with these bins in mind, uh, so that they would you know, fit really easily, but still there's things that I grab that, you know, might not fit that great. And one, one thing that oftentimes is a little bit awkward is boxes. Uh, you know, a box, you know, they're always uh, different sizes, different shapes, and sometimes they just don't fit well. And one way that you can kind of make things fit a little bit better is just take stuff out of the boxes. You can recycle the boxes or burn the boxes for fuel right away. And then you can take these things and the bags are gonna pack really easily. I'm putting all of our cereal into this bin here. Now, if I tried to put boxes into this bin, I would not be able to fit very many in there. But as bags, the bags crunch together and they you know, can pack the bin really fully. Now, one thing to make sure that you keep in mind when you do that is make sure you label what's in these bags. Now, I think it's fairly obvious that those are Cheerios, although Honey Nut Cheerios are almost identical in look. So any Honey Nut Cheerios that I have in here, I just write honey on them. And on these, I just don't write anything just because they're the normal Cheerios. Uh, and the other thing that's really important is put the expiration date or at the very least, just put the year and the month that you purchased them. Uh, so uh, that way, when you're going through your bin, you can make sure that you go and find the oldest thing and make sure you use that first so you don't just keep passing it over and then it goes bad. So that's it. I hope to see you guys tonight at 8.30 Eastern Standard Time. And please bring any questions that you may have about homestead building, retreat building, or even general emergency preparedness. That's it, and thanks for watching. This episode has been brought to you in part by Prescott Caliber Club and Jeske Defense Strategies. Prescott Caliber Club is a federally licensed firearm manufacturer and retail store specializing in firearms, survival gear, and producing great online content. If you want to thank them for supporting this channel, go check them out at prescottcalclub.com. Please subscribe and tune in every Friday at 4.30 New York time for a new video. And if you'd like to support this channel, you can do so both through Patreon or PayPal.